Hello. So today I thought I will speak about something that is very basic and essential. It's actually something that we all own just about the moment we are born. And that is our name. Now, this is a, well, it's a name is what you identify, you are identified by. It's said to be the sweetest sound to any person when you address a person by their name versus by any other references. Now today I speak about name as not just as a noun but as a verb. The name, um, from what I can see, from what I've seen a lot of times, is that Happens to be very interesting that of how a name comes to be given to a person. They look for a lot of names among amongst all the names that is possible in the world. Why do you think you have only that word as your name, and that stays with you for the rest of your life, and and you are addressed by it? There is a meaning to it, and um, and the meaning that the word that the name gets is also by how you live your life. And a name is a word, basically. And a word has a meaning. Now, you may have asked the meaning of your name to the people who gave you the name, or you may have even looked it up, or you already know the meaning of it. Nevertheless, every word has many meanings. From what I've seen, when you just Google your name, you would get some meanings of it, not only from your own country of origin, from your culture, religion, but sometimes the name has a history that's, that may be um, from many different countries, from different time zones. It could even be really old names. And, each, and in each of these languages, from each of these uh, regions, geographically, time-wise, the meaning according, according to the word would be different. Now, if you string together all the meanings that, that is there through time and space, um, and uh, another interesting fact is when you look up your name at different points on, in time, like if you look it up now, and then you look it up, say, a few months later, you might get further um, revelations, further meanings, more layers of it. And it will add on to the depth and the richness of the meaning that is accorded to that one word which is your name. Um, I invite you to just look up the different meanings of your names and put it down on a piece of paper or, or somewhere or, a, or on a book that is personal to you. <clears throat> and um, why do I speak all of this is this word, this name which is given to us, which is which becomes our which has become so inherent to our identity in some way, can be quite like, uh, can be quite a reason by which to live life. I have often found that my name is like the, um, like a goal that is yet to happen in the future, which has been already given to me when I was born. As I look up the meanings of, the, of my name and the different depths and depths and layers of it, I find reason and inspiration by which to live my life. It's like the future goal, or at least a, a very important part of what I want, of what I am destined to become in life, of what I could become in life, that has been given to me in the present by which which has a significance on how and it's, it's almost like a tool by which I get to where I need to get to in life. So I invite you to look at your name like, um, like the handle of a car, you know, a steering wheel of a car or, a, or the handlebar of a motorcycle or, or any two-wheeler for the matter, by which to sort of give a direction, to get a handle 
a new life and where you can get to in life by being connected with your name as a source of not only inspiration but as a resource to by which to fall back on every time you you may be missing a beat or or you may be veering off the track of of in be in becoming your best potential and becoming the best version of you so um so what's in a name i would say everything i hope you discover the wealth that's there in your own name best wishes